<laughs> that face gives you the whole that's, report. That face yeah, says everything. That my face says everything. Does it not? Do you need a? Re you really need a report? <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen the Nightmare on Elm Street? <laughs> that's Disney World. Not Disney, Disney World. World. Compared to where we are now, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Ontario 200 is a, is a cakewalk. <laughs> now we're in like 12 foot swells. <laughs> we're having fun. Oh, we're having fun, yeah. Oh. Woo! Oh. Oh. Yeah, we had some seasickness, but we're getting over with it. I'll give you a report. Yeah. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Alright. Well,. Last night we had the most eventful night. Um, went through some uh, thunder, lightning storms, some uh, good rainstorms, uh, with good downpour. Got the boat all cleaned anyway, outside. Uh, we had uh, up to 35 knot winds, um, which is a lot more than 35 knots in Lake Ontario, I'll tell you that. And the seas building huge seas uh, at some point, I don't know, all feet, maybe higher, we couldn't see them. But one of the waves knocked the boat right on its side. And uh, another one that was smaller than that, I was up and I went flying across the cabin. I forgot to tell you guys that. Went for like a tackle into the salon. <laughs> <laughs> I was airborne right across the cabin. And, and then the other one, I was sleeping down below when the boat went sideways. And, I, I was bounced around like a cracker jack, prize in a box. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, anyway, we reefed the main once and then twice, and then uh, then we then we had to uh, reef, take it right down. And in the middle of the night, says went out there uh, through the front window. Film it, says. Right there. Yeah. While he was harnessed in, and then we brought him in through the front window. Um, you know, we're, we're just, uh, it, it was pretty crazy. And uh, I think a couple of people got seasick sea again. Um, but our good captain here. Uh, <laughs> solid like a rock. Solid like a rock. <laughs> he got, he, he wanted to know when dinner was going to be served. He's looking for breakfast right now. Yeah, he's looking for breakfast. <laughs> But his scurvy crew ain't moving. <laughs> anyway, we're uh, heading into Jacksonville, Florida. We we're thinking of going to St. Augustine's, but we shortened course about 16 miles, three hours. We should put us there if all goes well at 8 p.m. this evening. Another 12 hours in the, in the land. At one point, we were uh, over 100 miles offshore, a couple hundred kilometers. Actually, when all that stuff was going down. Peter, have you seen the Elm Street, the Nightmare on Elm Street? Well, that's what we had last night. Well, actually, it was worse. And, um... <laughs> what did you it's say? One of those things I can't really express in words. <laughs> it's, it's, um... It's like, you're not sure if you're going to be going swimming for the night. <laughs> or you're just going to sink. <laughs> One of those crazy nights, and um, I've uh, enjoyed sailing. I'll never do it again. <laughs> but it was great. It was. I usually have a niche, so I need to go traveling. I, and I, you know, I get up and I move to another province. I think I cured it. <laughs> it doesn't itch anymore. I'm gonna settle down now. I've introduced myself many times to the floor, to the walls, and to that steel post out there. Here in Elm Street was like Disney World compared to what we're dealing with now. We had a bad beginning coming out through New York was kind of bad and it was rough as well with the seas and the big ships. And then we had kind of easy, you know, it wasn't so bad. And then the last leg of course before we get to port is got to be the worst thing I've ever experienced. So for any of those people that want to go traveling, some guy asks you, hey, you want to go to Florida with me? <laughs> Tell him no, straight out, no. <laughs> okay, simple as that. 